Mervyn baked cupcakes as beautiful as can be. They were vanilla and chocolate with twirly-whirly icing, sprinkles and coloured balls, ready for high tea. He placed them on a rack to cool, then went to get the Mongoose Cafe ready before everyone came in for tea and coffee on their way to work or school. Melda arrived bright and early. Morning, Mervyn. It's always good to see you, she said sincerely. Melda, would you mind pitching in? Could you fetch the cupcakes in the kitchen? Mm, Mervyn, she stuttered. What cupcakes? There is nothing on the cupboard. Mervyn came running. It can't be true. I placed them there this morning. Oh no, what do we do? They looked left and right, up and down, but no cupcakes anywhere around. Let's put our heads together, look for clues. To give up, we refuse. Kiddywinks, can you see any clues? Please have a look, we need your help too. On the floor near the window, did you notice the cake crumbs? Mervyn and Melda followed them out and down past the water spout. Fern Frog was resting on a lily pad in the sun. Morning Fern, you haven't perhaps seen someone with cupcakes make a run? No, I'm sorry, I've just arrived. What about Dante working over there at the hive? Mervyn, Melda, why do you look so glum? Dante, can you help? We're in a bit of a plum. The cupcakes for the cafe have gone astray. I'm sorry I can't help, but what about Eggnog, the police dog? Mervyn called Eggnog. Good morning to you. We need your help. Please can you come through? Eggnog arrived just a little later. Don't worry guys, I've brought my navigator. With his navigator in hand and his nose to the ground, Eggnog set off sniffing around. Over the hill, what did he find? Fred Fiskel Shrike looking in a bind. Fred, what's happening here? Oh, Eggnog, help! I'm caught in a snare. I see the snare. I'll loosen and destroy it. But what are the cupcakes I see over there? Ah, about those, you see. That's easy to explain. I went to visit Mervyn before he opened the cafe. As I landed on the windowsill, my foot hooked on the cooling rack as I turned to the doorway. I got a fright and flew off. The cupcakes were caught and wouldn't drop off. As you can see, they are all still there. I didn't eat any. I didn't dare. Eggnog the police dog helped Fred Fiskel Shrike free and off they set to the cafe with smiles of glee. Mervyn and Melda, look what we have. Your delicious cupcakes, thanks to my sat-nav. Mervyn made tea and brought out the plates. Everyone enjoyed the delicious cupcakes. <laughs>